recycling bins are popping up all over campus at Georgia College and State University. 41 NBC's Brittany Gonzalez has more on how students in the Environmental Science Club are leading the way in keeping their campus eco-friendly. The more that goes into these, the happier these students get. I hope that it will replace trash cans. Daniel and Michael and about 40 other students have made it their mission to recycle everything they can. There could definitely be a greater awareness of it because every single day, not a day passes, where I see at least one person putting a can or a bottle into a trash bin. It doesn't take that much extra effort and um, I think we all just maybe should try to work together a little on what we have here on our planet. And students and faculty at GCSU are noticing. The bins are filling up weekly now. <laughs> at first, people are having a hard time finding them. These bins have nearly doubled in a year. We have 50 bins in almost every building on campus now. Through this recycling program, about 16,000 pounds of recyclable items have stayed out of landfills. And it's also helped students take responsibility for their daily consumption of products. We have students actually analyzing their material usage because a lot of people think that once you're done with something you just throw it away and it's gone but really it has to go someplace. Keeping it out of the landfill has the potential to save the school big bucks. We spend over $150,000 a year on waste removal here and so if we can cut back on that that'll create more positions, more jobs, more opportunities for students and maybe lower the cost of tuition. In Milledgeville, Brittany Gonzalez, 41 NBC News. The Environmental Science Club's goal is to cut the college's amount of trash in half. The recycling program is also free for the school to participate in. If you have an idea for going green, saving green, we want to hear about it. Whether it's at home or at work or just an idea, let us know. Send us an email to goinggreen at 41nbc.com.